Hebron, the second largest city in the West Bank, is the only Palestinian city with a Jewish settlement at its heart. To enable the few hundred settlers to move about freely, the army has severely restricted the movement of Palestinians. Israeli policies have radically changed the face of Hebron's city centre. Only Jews are allowed to use main streets in the city. Palestinians are forbidden from entering them. On these streets, the army totally prevents Palestinian movement. On other streets, the army prohibits the entry of Palestinian vehicles. The army closed hundreds of shops in the market area. The entire market has stopped functioning. Except curfews are often imposed on the residents following acts of terror. Curfews have also been imposed on Palestinians following riots by settlers or to enable settlers to hold public events. To allow a small number of settlers to carry out their daily routine, Israel has made the lives of tens of thousands of Palestinians intolerable. Thousands of Palestinian residents and merchants had to leave the city center. What was once a lively residential and commercial area is now a ghost town. My name is Leila Sarsour. I am a girl, like everybody else. It's not talking about guarding the borders of Israel. You know, when I joined the army, I went you know, to protect my country. It's talking about protecting 500 settlers inside a Palestinian city. If we leave, everybody will leave. This country will never be called Palestine. You can't pass this road. No, you my friends. Because you know you can't pass. You are here I now. I am very clear. You are here now. Shh, no, and I am I'm very not here. clear. You I are here now. Let us what? collect it no. now. No. Where uh, our school is, it's like something like this in the middle. We have here Arab people and here the settlers. The ghosts around them have to pay the price. It's never the settlers who pay the price. It's always the Palestinians who pay the price. When you say Palestine, that you will think, yeah, they will have, they have many, many problems, and they, all of them, are terrorists because nobody knows the truth about about Palestinian people and Israeli people and about the whole situation here. No. It's time. You see? You see? You see? Ah, I see, I see. Go there. Okay. All right. I have the right. Six seven. Six seven. What? Six seven. Come. Six seven. Come.